Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So today I decided to do a what's in my figure skating bag video and figure skaters have a lot of accessories and equipment they use so I'm going to show you what's in my figure skating bag. So this is what my bag looks like. It's Vera Bradley and it has like cute green flowers on it and it's really cute. So the first thing you see when you open my bag are obviously my skates. So I have the Adea skates and I have John Wilson Pattern 99 blades on them. I absolutely love these skates. Um, this is by far the best boot that I have owned out of all of my skates. And I really love the blades because they are so smooth on the ice and they glide really well and they keep a really good edge. And then on my skates are just these green soakers that just soak up the water after I wipe them off and this is what I keep them in, in my bag, so. Do you like them? Do you like them? The next thing in my bag is just this towel. It's like really cute on both sides. It's just to wipe off the excess ice and water um, on my blades after I'm done skating and it's really soft and I really like it. The next thing in my bag is something really, really helpful for all figure skaters, and that is gloves. I have a lot of different pairs of gloves because um, they get holes in them pretty easily, so I always keep extra pairs in my bag just in case and keeps my hands warm. Also in this little pocket are my band-aids. Well, there were band-aids in here, but now they are all over my floor. So, band-aids, because skates are sharp. Yay! You want a glove? Anyway, the next thing in my bag that I see are my skate guards. These are just really helpful when you're trying to walk from concrete onto the ice, so. Also in my bag is my CD holder for my music. It has an A side, which is full, and then it has a B side, which I think is also full. Oh, almost full. So yeah. As you can see, I have a favorite color. Green. It's green. I also found some music just in different holders. So, another thing in my skate bag is skate tape and scissors for it. Skate tape is really helpful if you are trying to preserve the front part of your skate. Like if you're going to be working on a really hard jump and you might nick it and you want to keep your skates nice, then you can always tape the front or the sides and then um, it's really helpful for the skate at the top when you have them tied and you can't wear leggings to put over the laces to keep them in place. Skate tape is really helpful to wrap around and make sure that your laces don't go anywhere during competition or practice or whatever. So skate tape is really helpful and I like to keep two rolls in my bag. I also keep a bunch of laces in my bag because you never know when you will either cut your laces or slice them with your other skate or something happens to them so I always keep extra ones in my bag. The next thing I have in my bag are um, skate inserts and these are the original Adea ones that were in my skate but because I had an arch issue and my feet were having a little bit of problems I decided to get some different insoles for my skate just to help with my arches and to make sure my feet weren't flattened out into my skate. So I'm gonna go ahead and show you. So this is what my insert for my skate looks like now. It's got a really supported arch, so my foot is not flat in my skate. It ha it's raised at the arch. Um, and it really improved my foot pain and like, the problems I was having with my uh, feet during skating. 
It's by the brand Superfeet and it's just this yellowish greenish color and I've kept them in my skate ever since I found them so I really like them and they're really helpful. Found a nickel. And the last things in my figure skating bag are these Adia lace straps which is kind of like the tape, um, the skate tape that you use to hold down your laces. And then I just found this random bag, I don't know what this is. Oh, it's a hair ribbon. It's a hair ribbon. You look beautiful. So that's all that was in my figure skating bag. I really hope you guys enjoyed this video. I really enjoyed making it. So if you like this video, go ahead and give it a thumbs up and um, hit that subscribe button. Hit that subscribe button and comment down below what you thought. And <laughs> I will see you in my next video. <laughs>